It's a quick news break with yours truly. I'm the one and only. I go by the name of Mr. Telefero. Please make sure you're following your boy on Instagram at is Mr. Telefero. Charlotte, North Carolina is on the baby. One of the hottest rappers in the world right now. Just recently dropped a new project. Blame it on baby. Well, once again, somebody's trying to blame it on baby. According to TMZ, there is an active arrest warrant out for the baby on a misdemeanor battery charge. Uh, TMZ is reporting that in last November, the baby and a couple of his homies hopped into a Sprinter van and they they started smoking some weed. The driver told them to put the weed out. He's like, y'all can't do that in my car. According to this driver, he's claiming the rapper and his friends started cursing him out, threatening him. And when they got to the destination that they were going to, which was the Hard Rock Hotel, the driver told his passengers it was time to pay up, including the baby. And the driver claims the baby punched him in the back of the head and said, you ain't the boss. That's according to the driver. Again, he is probably going to try to get a bag out of the baby. According to the driver, he says somebody that was with the baby even went as far as to tell him, you know, you're lucky you're not in my city because I would have killed you, you cracker motherfucker. Uh, also, apparently, the driver heard someone say they would have left the driver for dead on the road. So they, according to this driver, they, the, the baby and his team made some threats in his direction. Look, let me be clear with you guys. My name is Mr. Telefero. I do not work for a radio station right now. I work for self. If you want to say I work for somebody, you can say I'm employed by Google or YouTube. But I don't work for a radio station. Why do you say that? reason why I bring that up is because a lot of your favorite media personalities, I don't care what station it is, they like to cape up for people that they like or sometimes love, have relationships with, need for radio shows, need for radio interviews. Right now, where I'm at in the place of my career, I don't need anyone for anything. Uh, this is not an interview contingent platform. This is not a radio show platform. I don't need to cape up for the baby. Let me just be clear. The baby has not shown me anything personally for me to say that this shit ain't true. Okay, a couple months ago, right before we went on quarantine, there was a viral video of the baby putting his hands on a female. He literally slapped the chick as she did reach for him. He slapped her straight up and down in the club. And he apologized for it, but he slapped it. Okay, months before that, in December, the baby was at a hotel. And I'm not saying he's 100% wrong about this one, but you got to have better security than this. He was at a Miami hotel. I think this hotel employee took a picture of the baby while he was with his daughter. And the baby just walked up to bruh and put hands on him. You can't do that. You're a high-profile rapper. You just can't do that. Okay, a few months before that, the baby was in another, another alleged incident, and we when he put hands on someone else, allegedly. Then we got the incident with Cam Cole Hart, in which the baby recorded himself beating the shit out of Cam Cole Hart last year. My point is, the baby has shown me nothing to believe that he wouldn't hit his driver in the back of the head who told him he couldn't smoke in his vehicle. Again, all your favorite media personalities, maybe Joe Budden is the only one that I've seen keep it real, but Charlemagne, uh, Ebro Nim, uh, Big Boy Nim, all they do is cape up sway. I and mean, I love all these guys and all these and all the down south media personalities as well. They always look for the rapper's way out. I don't work for rappers. I don't work for radio stations. The baby has shown me personally nothing, and I have nothing but respect for the baby musically. But the baby has shown me nothing to not believe this driver who claims the baby put his hands on him, hit him in the back of the head. And the driver says, the baby said, you're not, you ain't the boss. That sounds a lot like the baby because what, what I see from the baby is a guy who is obsessed with being the man, being the man in every room he's in. He's obsessed with power. I hope this story ain't true. I have no idea if it's true or not. I know the baby went on his social media account and 100% denied it. He said these, th these allegations are false. We've seen the baby do that before and it be true. So, I mean, we'll see what happens. This pro this thing will probably get played down in court and then he'll have to send a bag over to the driver. Uh, y'all let me know what y'all think about it in the comment box below. You know, we try to get in and out with the news breaks, but when I see there's somewhere for me to put my opinion on, on it, I'm, I'm gonna let you know what I think. And I just, I'm sorry, maybe the baby's telling him the truth, but it's like the little boy who cried wolf. When you put your hands on a woman, I believe you can do anything. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment box below. Again, the baby has been hit, according with T to TMZ, 
uh, with a misdemeanor battery charge in Vegas for putting his hands on a driver. There's an active arrest warrant out for him right now, so he probably should stay out of Vegas for the foreseeable future. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment box below. I'm out. Hey! Hey, Leon! If you down on scene, if you reach my chain, chain, then you know we slaying. Nah, I'm about that. Northside landlord, I ain't playing about that. that. NBA be my game, bitch, I stand on that. Real diamonds on my neck with the bands on that. Bitch, nigga, call my phone on. Never call back. Call three and tell them niggas I don't want to chat in the studio is shade in the studio is strange on the grind every day I've been chasing, chasing that same real third eight baby I'm from call the track You can keep your little money I don't want to do no track One million views and we're starting a day Take a night that I'm sleeping I'm keeping me a You heard me yeah I can clutch on no glitch of being keeping